A court in China found Canadian businessman Michael Spavor guilty of spying on Wednesday, sentencing him to 11 years in prison, in a decision likely to further undermine already poor relations between China and Canada. Spavor, who for years ran a travel and cultural exchange business between China and North Korea, was convicted of espionage and illegally providing state secrets, Dandong City's Intermediate People's Court said in a statement. He was sentenced to 11 years in prison. The court said Spavor, whose closed-door trial in March lasted little more than two hours, would also be deported, but did not say when, and confiscated some of his personal property. China's courts are controlled by the Communist Party and have a near 100 percent conviction rate in criminal trials. Spavor has 10 days to appeal the decision, but you said the process was long, uncertain, and unlikely to be successful. On Tuesday, a Chinese court rejected an appeal by Robert Schellenberg, a Canadian sentenced to death for drug smuggling. Barton, the Canadian ambassador, condemned the ruling and called for clemency.